I've got a quick tutorial video here on how to remove a smart graphics file uh, from your UC Engine. Uh, if you've got these three little lines here in the bottom right hand screen of your, uh, your, your touch panel, uh, I'm going to show you how to remove those. Uh, so what you need to do is you need to log in the admin side of your uh, UC, your settings, <coughs> type in your password. And you're going to go to Windows settings in the bottom left. And I'm using the uh, Crestron Remote Connect software. I'm not using the actual touch panel in the room. Uh, administrator in the bottom left. And then type the password in. Type the password in correctly. Then we're going to go to the Crestron settings from the Windows icon, the Windows icon on the bottom left. And you're going to go up to Crestron, and the first thing we need to do is we need to remove the IP table. Crestron the IP table, and then select the IP table, and then hit Remove. All right, and then we're going to hit Done, and then go to your File Explorer on the bottom. And you're going to go to uh, the C drive. And we're going to go to Program Files. We're going to go to the Crestron folder. We're going to go to the CCS400 Users and Display. And then all these files in here, we want to de delete every single one of these. And now we can log back into the, uh, uh, the regular Teams side. and those lines should be gone. Skype and hit sign in. And once the interface loads, those three slider bars in the bottom right hand corner of the 1060 should be gone. There we go. Easy as that. Like, comment, subscribe. Hey.